What's up guys, today we're talking about the noon pricing and I'm just going to give you a couple of things to think about if you're thinking through the pricing. So the pricing is actually pretty simple, it's on the website, you can go ahead and check it out, I'll flash it up here on the screen for you. But the thing I want to talk about is what does the pricing actually get you and how does it make sense or how does it not make sense. I've been doing Noom for almost three months now and the thing I've learned about Noom is that it really addresses the heart, the core of why you're eating. And this is important to know because like you know, diets and fad diets and all of that, they work for the time you're doing it. but. Most likely, science says that you're gonna gain all the weight back. You revert to your old habits, your stresses and your triggers are still there, and so all that diet you did was basically for nothing. Noom is different because it addresses the core of the problem, it addresses the root of it, and so even if you're off Noom, you, you finish the Noom program, well, you're still gonna have the tools that Noom gives you to apply and use in your day-to-day -day life. And this has saved me money tangibly in two ways. One is just retail therapy, Black Friday was just around the corner, it just happened, and I have realized that this Black Friday, yes, I bought some stuff, but it was a lot more tame. Years past, I would have bought a jacket that I didn't need or some shirts that I don't need, and that easily adds up to more than 60 bucks a month. The other way to think about this is an investment. It's an investment in yourself, in your health. You're investing 60 bucks a month now, so that in the future you avoid doctor visits and treatment and all of that which can cost hundreds and thousands of dollars. So I would rather spend some money up front here, take care of my health, become more sustainable, have energy, and avoid just spending all that money later. So I wanted to share a couple of tools that Noom has taught me over the last few months and hopefully that helps you out. So as I mentioned, stress was a big trigger for me, that's why I end up binge eating and eating a lot. And so really if you think about it, food is not really the problem for me really it's the stress and it's not that I can't have ice cream or chocolate or whatever it's the fact that I was binging on that because I wanted to cope with my stress I wanted to just you know distract myself from the actual stress and so what Noom has taught me is that no I can have ice cream I can have chocolate although in moderation and then they gave me the tools to actually deal with the stress itself. So this is huge. There will be a day where I am not subscribed to Noom anymore when I don't do it anymore, but I'll still be able to use the tools that I learned. The other thing that I learned through Noom is that I use food as a reward. And so after a long day of work, or if I you know, figure something out at work, etc., I will use food to reward myself. And that's just a habit that I've developed over the years, but instead of using food, I can use other things to reward myself. And so what I've done is I've given myself 10 to 15 minutes of just uninterrupted YouTube time where I'm just on my phone, just hanging out, just relaxing. And that time by myself is a replacement for food. Instead of having a second serving or a piece of chocolate or whatever, this 10, 15 minutes is the reward so less calories into my body. And I'd say the third and most impactful thing Noom has taught me is what it's like to eat mindfully. Before, because I was just in the hustle and bustle, I would just scarf down food or I would eat things while watching things on my phone or just, just wouldn't really be present. And so I would just be eating and the calories would be just stacking up, but I just wouldn't know because I wouldn't be aware. And so with Noom, with food logging and just being more mindful, um, using the tools, like engaging the senses, really helps me to just slow down and just eat less and eat less calories and help me meet my weight goal. So that pretty much covers what I wanted to share with you today. Just wanted to go over the pricing, wanted to give you a couple of things to think about when you're thinking through the pricing. Wanted to share a couple of lessons I've learned through Noom and hopefully that was helpful for you. I think the biggest takeaway, if I could summarize, is that Noom is designed in a way for you not to need Noom in the future. It's designed in a way that you won't need to be on Noom forever. It's kind of like fatherhood if you think about it. You're teaching your kids not to need you anymore. That's, that's like Noom. Noom is teaching you not to need Noom anymore. So I've mentioned I've been doing Noom almost three months now. I wanted to give you a two month update. I've got some unfortunate news. I've plateaued a little bit, but that's okay. Um, you know, within this past month, we made a trip down to SoCal and I just couldn't resist the In-N-Out burgers, it's just so good. So actually within, you know, almost the first three months, if you were to chart my weight loss, it would be like, I lost a lot of weight and then after the trip, I almost gained it all the way back, but that's okay. I'm still on the wagon. I am still 
being consistent about eating veggies and exercise and all of that good stuff and I can see my weight is slowly starting to decrease now getting my energy back and all that good stuff so that's all I wanted to share with you if you want to join me in battling the dad bod just reclaiming your energy just being at the top of your game consider using my code below they've given me a code that will give you 20% off so that will shave the cost of the program for yourself um, yeah, just give it a shot. I mean, I would love to be a part of your weight loss journey, not because of weight and all of that, but just reclaiming your life back, you know, like, I just got tired of, like, feeling tired all the time, and so I wanted to do something more, quote-unquote, drastic or try something new, um, and so that's why I started Noom, and, you know, my goal is to lose a pound a week through the end of the year, so we've got about four or five more weeks, so I want to lose four or five more pounds through the end of the year. Hope you guys will join me. I don't have to say that this year has been crazy, but we can take control at the end of the year at least and start 2021 off on the right foot. Use the code below. If you don't like it, worst thing that can happen is you ask for a cancellation and maybe they will drop the price on you. Maybe they won't. Who knows? If you want to learn more about how the two-week free trial was, click on the link up here. If you want to learn about the first month of my Noom experience, click on the link up here as well. Hope you make it a great day. Take care of your health. See you guys on the next one.